Good morning, good afternoon, my dear friends. I missed you a lot. How are you guys doing? It's Natalia here, and you're listening to Voyage Podcast, the podcast about news in English. I'm reminding you that here we don't learn any grammar. Here we don't speak or translate in Russian. We just discuss some news in the world and have fun together. Now, I'm a little bit busy with my other projects. That is why I don't publish my videos that often. But I will get back to this soon, okay? I hope that you are learning English with us on Meaningful English Course for Beginners. If you have any questions, please contact me. In this podcast, I speak more slowly. Don't forget that there is a link to a transcript below this video. I also recommend you to listen to this episode two or three times and speak along with me. Let's improve speaking skills. As usual, the news in this episode are taken from the website called newsandlevels.com, of course. Today, we've got three news. I want you to tell me when do you listen to my podcast? Maybe you listen while you're going to work or while you're having breakfast or dinner. Please write the answer in the comments below. Your comments and likes help other people find our channel. Before we start, I want to announce my news. I am creating a new voyage chat on Telegram for speaking and writing practice. If you are interested, please text me on Telegram. Just hit the link below this video and I will add you to our group. Perfect! So now we can start! News number one. Birds fall from the sky. A security camera in a Mexican city films something unusual. Birds fall from the sky. Oh, wow! The birds look like a black cloud. There are a lot of birds, right? So, they look like a black cloud on the sky and they fly to the ground. Most birds fly away. Some animals stay on the ground. They die. People have different opinions about this event. Opinion is what a person thinks about something. 
Some people say that dirty air is the problem of the birds. Others say that electricity kills the animals. Many people believe that there is a predator. You know, predator is an animal which kills another animal and it eats it. For example, a tiger is a predator because he kills deer to eat it. The birds want to fly away from the predator. Then they are confused. When you are confused, you cannot think clearly. You're like, oh, I'm confused. Where to go? This way or that way? So, the birds are confused and they hit the ground. The birds are yellow-headed blackbirds. They stay in the U.S. and Canada in the summer. They fly to Mexico for winter because it is warmer in Mexico. That was news number one. Was it interesting to you? I hope so. So please now listen to news number two. Skater takes illegal drug. Oh, this one is totally popular these days because there are Olympic Games, right? And now everybody knows Kamila Valieva. Who is Kamila Valieva? She is a figure skater. Figure skater is a person who moves quickly and jumps on ice. Figure skating is a kind of sport. It is very beautiful. So she comes from Russia, right? She is 15 years old. She's very young. And Camilla is at the Winter Olympic Games in China. Valeva and her team win a gold medal at the Games. Wow! Perfect! But officials give them no medals. Wow! A Swedish lab checks Valeva's blood in December. Valeva has an illegal drug in her blood. <gasps> the name of the drug is trimetazidine. Oh, I'm not going to repeat it. Athletes can't use it since 2014. They train harder and longer with the drug. Okay, what is a drug? Drug is a medicine or thing which affects the body. A court must decide what happens to Valeva. The court 
will say if Valieva can be in other Olympic events. This news was just super popular in all the countries, right? I think that you heard it before this podcast. Yeah, we were all shocked, right? And now we are moving to news number three. And this one is a little bit short and a little bit more cute, okay? It's about an animal, which is a cat, okay? And news number three is called Mitzi the Cat. Mitzi, Mitzi is a name of a cat. So Mitzi is a cat. She lives at a station in Israel. Israel is a country. She lies around the station. She watches people. She sits on Ticket gates. You know, the ticket gates are a little wall which lets you go through only if you have a ticket. So there are ticket gates in the subway in Moscow. And many people like Mitzi. She makes them feel good. But some people do not like cats. They are afraid of them. They can also be allergic to cats. When you are allergic to something, your body starts to feel bad. Your eyes can be red, your skin can be red, you know. Maybe you are allergic to cats. And the station manager knows this. He wants everybody to be happy and guess what he is looking for a home for Mitzi oh isn't that cute I hope that you like animals as much as I do that was news number three and that's it for today, guys. Oh my god, time flies with you. This was a wonderful time. And here is the end of episode number four. Don't forget to text me about the speaking chat on Telegram. Also, don't forget to like this video and give me some feedback about the news. I love reading your comments. Also, if you need a transcript, here it is below this video. You just click the link and it will be shown on your screen. I love you all and I hope to see you next time here. Have a great week. Peace.